Nissan is offering a new midnight edition treatment on six of its models, the Altima, Sentra, Maxima, Rogue, Murano, and Pathfinder. As the name kinda suggests, it features black wheels and other dark finish exterior elements across all these cars. Chevy initially introduced its Redline package on a SEMA show concept and will soon offer it on nine models by the end of 2017. Redline cars get unique red hash marks on the wheels and black badges, among other tweaks. The Mitsubishi Outlander Sport Limited Edition builds upon the base ES trim. You get a lot of features for a pretty low price, but you still have to live with an Outlander Sport, so it's kind of a wash. Infinity bundles a bunch of popular equipment together to create signature editions of both the Q50 sedan and QX80 SUV. The biggest differentiator between these models and the base trims are new sets of wheels on both vehicles. Not only does the full-size Toyota Sequoia SUV finally get a facelift, it comes to market with this new TRD Sport trim that makes it a little bit more interesting. I've never really paired the words RAV4 and Adventure together, but nevertheless, Toyota's small crossover gets a little more rugged thanks to some visual tweaks. Ram brings a pair of special editions to Chicago with an orange tinted copper sport trim on the half ton 1500 and a night package on the heavy duty 2500 which brings black badges to this white truck. But coolest of all the special editions to me is this Jeep Wrangler Recon. With beefier off-road chops and a really awesome appearance, this is one hell of a proper send-off for this generation of Wrangler.